don't know who you're doing with, right? Uche, you, you, want me, you want me to finish Uche, you get out of my house. I'll, I'll do it. Get out of my house. I'm going to kill you. 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 It's okay, it's okay. It's okay. Uchi, it's okay. It's okay. Uchi, 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 I'll get you down. So William says it's okay. I'll get you down. It's okay, you shout. Can you imagine? Can you imagine? Can you imagine Uchi and me? Me, Williams. Well, he is your cousin. You don't have to fight him, okay? And besides, you're creating sin. People are listening. Okay? Just pick your car. I need to talk to you. Sorry. Okay. You can stop this time, okay? You can sort it out. Just come with me. I need to talk to you right now. Okay? Chama, my daughter. See, there is an adage that says, Whosoever lives in a glass house must never throw stones. Akuna, your brother, he disobeyed me. When he wanted to become a deacon in a church, I did not agree with him. Then he wanted to become a reverend father. He never got my blessing. But what did he do? He went ahead as a plan. Though the Bible tells him that thou shalt not disobey your parents. So, yet he did. Akuna, my only true son, which was why I named him Akuna, the father's wealth. My son that should have carried on the legacy of my name, he disobeyed me. And that singular act of disobedience was what pushed me to go in search of Williams. Well, lucky enough for me, I found him. And I brought him in. So you see, there is no need for this fussing and, and scapegoating that Akuna is doing. Because he should have listened to me in the first place. Dad, are you trying to say that Williams is your biological son? Chama, I am not trying to say, my darling. I am telling you that William is my son. I can't, I can't believe it, Dad. Not after 28 years. Well, sweet yourself. He is my son. We have to do a DNA test. Very well. DNA test. Tell me what it takes. I mean, what is going to cost me to join this group? I mean, give me assurance that I will join your group. You know, I leave all these people. I can handle them. They're my in-laws. I know how to handle them, okay? Listen, you've proven to me that you're serious. I am, of course. I'll give you a call. For real? Yeah. Like, does it mean I'm going to join you? Yeah, you're in. For real? Honestly, no, you don't know how excited I am. I don't care. I'm so happy, yes. Honestly. Oh, see how you're here. It's like I was telling you, see, there are so many ways of handling this kind of issues. There's no point for all this quarrel now. Uh, it's not worth it. There's still so many ways you can you can handle the issue. Can I talk to you briefly, please? Sorry, one second, darling. So 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 maybe later we'll talk, okay? Just take it easy. Let me talk to my wife, okay? I didn't even know the meeting was going, I just came around to pick my wife and I was see you, okay? Okay. Ellen, where's She went to see someone immediately after the meeting. Oh, I see. Okay, when she comes back, I'll tell her I called, okay? Yes, Father. Still a few inside.
You didn't believe what I heard when I went to the other side of it today. Can you believe that your father willed all his wealth and property to that boy, Williams? What are you talking about now? That's impossible. Are you sure of what you're saying? Huh? How could you do a thing like that? <laughs> I saw it with my eyes. Touched it. And even read the will written and signed by your father, Caesar. I have always known your father to be very stubborn and unbendable when it comes to certain decisions. But I never knew he could go this far with his flesh and blood. Huh. Well, um, mother, there's something Chema is suggesting, and I think um, that our suggestion is our best option right now. What is it? We go for a DNA test. Uh, DNA test? Yeah. Um, well, I think it, it is a wonderful idea. Yes, mom, because with that we can fight him traditionally. Yes. Um, our tradition even makes it clear that um, once a man dies, his first son inherits all his properties. <coughs> yeah, yeah. Hey! This is wonderful. How come I never thought of this all this while? Eh? Best option. That was a good suggestion, my dear. Hey! You are welcome. Oh, thank you very much. Uh, can we go inside? And... No, we don't need to go inside. We can talk here. You said you are from who? Caesar. The man you fortified and made indestructible. Oh, Caesar? Yes. He's a very nice man. The community speaks highly of him. He has built schools, helped a lot of widows. He has given scholarships to many people in this community. But he doesn't have a peaceful home. That is why I helped him to keep him alive. Because he has many enemies and they want to kill him. Now listen to me. I am here to warn you. Stay away from Caesar. And don't you ever, ever do anything again to save his life. I don't understand you. Who are you? Who I am is not important. What you need to know is that you should stay away from Caesar. He knows his fate and he cannot run away from it. After all, most good men don't live long. He has lived long enough. Heed my advice. Zomba Kajiga Zomba Hega 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 Zomba Kajiga Zomba my brother-in-law, Fidelis, told me he wants to join the Brotherhood. Did you scrutinize him properly? And uh, has he proven his mettle? Oh yes, I did. Severally. And he has proven to me that he's going to be a worthy candidate. Oh yes. Alright then. Yeah, 
a letter will be sent to your wife and I need you to pretend like you don't know anything about that letter and secondly I do not want you to be at home when the letter arrives okay now after she reads the letter I want you to burn the letter exactly yes I want you to burn it now that's your invitation to the brotherhood yes I said that's your invitation to the brotherhood and remember Fidelis you must not be at home when the letter arrives good From where? If he sees it, he will know. My name is Neto. I am here to see your husband, Caesar. He's not around. Why don't you just call him on the phone so that he will tell you where you both of you can meet? See, this is a Christian home. People like you are not welcome here. We have a Reverend Father here. In fact, the peace of the Most High God. Please, just go. What do you mean by that woman? I have a problem that only your husband Caesar can solve. Besides, am I not a human being like you? Hmm. Uh, there is nothing to worry about. I will come again. I'm not harmful. Uh, uh, no, listen to me. It's impossible. You are not needed in this compound at all, at all. Don't come back. Call him a phone now. Don't you know where you normally meet? Have you ever been here before? Just go, go and meet him there. Don't come here. We have enough scene here that the blood of Jesus is cleansing us from. So I don't want you to come and add your own problem. Go. Uh, mind you, I am not half. Uh, go, go, be, be, go, go, just go. You are not half. Why did you cover the other eye too with your white chalk? Against flesh and blood, 
Tell are you home? Daddy! Hi. Oh, good to see you. Welcome. Yeah, yeah. Who brought you his gift? Um, someone just dropped it for Felix a few moments ago. Why would Fidelis want to kill my daughter? Oh, Fidelis. You want to kill my daughter? Daddy, what are you talking about? Oh, Fidelis. Fidelis. You want the coffee? Yes, hello, it's Caesar here. Right, I'll call you back shortly. Daddy, what's going on? Let's go. Daddy, what is going on? What, what's wrong with the letter? What? The what are you not saying to me? Okay. All right. I'll be waiting for you. Yes. Daddy. 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 Okay. Hey. Stop, 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 Daddy. What? What? What is it? Daddy. Come down, come down. Come down. Daddy. Come on, help me. Stop. <laughs> Master! Master! What is it? Master! human but spirit. I've not killed anybody. I've saved your life. Do not hurt me. <laughs> so what do we do now? Well, I want you to know that this battle is not yet over. The only way we can win this battle is by not allowing anybody to touch that body. You understand me? I understand. But it's safe where it is. That's good.
Cuman So I don't know. Choma took it away with her cab. What nonsense are you talking about? Are you are you crazy? Are you crazy? I'm talking to you. Are you crazy? When dad came into the house, he saw the letter. He's there screaming that Fidelis wants to kill me. I didn't understand what he was saying, you know, and I was confused. Is it possible that he will want to kill me? He joined a secret cult? I can't believe it. You don't say. Mr. Collier, we do not want people to know that uh, the body of our father is here. You see, when my father was alive, he belonged to a particular group that cuts off somebody parts of the members when they die. And we do not want such to happen to our own father. And um, what about um, your family members? Are they not supposed to know about it? No, 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 no. Only both of us should know about this arrangement, please. Yes. Disturbing news? Yes. What do you tell us? That Caesar is dead. And the worst of it all, that his body is nowhere to be found. What? That's impossible. Who told you that? Williams. No way. That cannot be. Because I believe his family knows the whereabouts of his body. So I suggest we keep them under surveillance. Because we must get his advice. Of course. Yeah. Of course. That is not negotiable. Absolutely not negotiable. His body must be presented before Almighty Sumba for final rituals. Yes. Simply put. Where have you been? I want to see a friend. Are you hungry? Your food is ready. Oh, 
Oh no, I'm not hungry now. You were hungry before you left the house and I was cooking. Now the food is ready. Why aren't you hungry? Did you eat outside? No, I, I, I didn't eat outside. Of course. Maybe I, maybe I lost my appetite or something. And of course, if you know I'm hungry, I, I'll walk straight to the dining table. I'm Sir. Good afternoon. What of your mother? She went to see a friend who her daughter just put to bed. Why don't you come inside? Daddy should be home by now. Okay, I'm waiting for Williams. Okay, sir. What is the status? I still cannot find the body. Or where they have taken it to. Pacing up and down. Is there anything wrong? No, I'm okay. I'm fine. You're sure there's nothing wrong? No, if I'm perfect, I'm, I'm fine. Just like, uh, you know, like I went out and came in. So I'm like trying to know, did anybody look for me here? No. None that I know of. Were you expecting anyone? Well, yes. Uh, oh, oh, no. <laughs> it's just that I felt like, you know, I've been out and I like, just came in and I need to be sure. Uh, oh, yes. Oh, yes. Oh, yes. Someone came looking for you. Someone dropped a letter for you. A letter? Are you serious? So, where's the letter? I gave it to my father. What? Jumai, you did? Hi! Hey! So, it is true. What is true? It is true you want me dead. It is true what my father told me. You fidelis. Of all people, my husband, you want me dead. Eh, who Me? You demon, blood sucking demon. You do it. Do not say anything. You, of all people, you want me dead. See, I'm really sorry I can explain. Please shut up. Explain what? What is there to explain? That you want me dead? How are you going to explain that? How are you going to explain that? Tell me! I'm so, so, I'm so sorry, Chama. Is, 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 is this Williams? I mean... Um, my father is dead. What? What happened? Uh, calm down, calm down, calm down. You see, we are all living under that death's permanent threat. And um, death, as all we all know, does not issue warnings to those who's about to take. Um, I'm telling you these things because I, I would need your help sooner than later. So at this moment, I want you to keep it as a secret. Okay? Okay, I will. I will. Oh, God. Uncle 
season. Now listen and listen good. I don't want anyone to find out that my father is late. Have I made myself clear? Yes, sir. Do you understand what I just said? Yes, sir. Uncle Williams, Madam said I should call you. Something wrong? I don't know. Okay, tell her I'll be with her shortly. Okay. I don't really understand what is happening in this house today. People have been actually coming in one after the other. Yes. What did he say? He said he's coming. Mm -hmm. Honestly, guys. I'm afraid though. I don't understand what is happening in this house anymore. In fact, I must leave for my parents' house tomorrow. For what? I will receive my salary if I leave this house. Tell me you're dreaming. You're talking about salary. Not when William is in charge. Ah! Okay. Can we just take a look at the corpses in the No, 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 no. It's not wise, it's not possible. We are not operating that way. You can't. Do we have an understanding now? Immediately. <laughs> Shall we? Oh, yeah. 
the great thing will go through. The pride of the Madokas family. You are gone. You turned the tears of widows and the helpless in this community into joy. You did great things as a brave man. Indeed, you did not pass through this generation unnoticed. Your memory will forever be cherished. Goodbye. And safe journey home, my dear brother Caesar. Goodbye. Oh, Papa, what was the meaning of that? Come, Mazi, come. Come. Sit down. You see, my son, according to tradition, when a man does both great things and terrible things like your uncle Caesar did and dies. You perform the rituals I just performed by pouring away water which signifies that the man goes home with all the evil things he has done. He will never ever reincarnate again. No, no, Papa. Since you know he was evil, why were you praising him then? <laughs> Part of what I was trying to explain to you, my son. You do not speak ill of the dead. Come, let's go in. Let judgments be between the dead and uh, God. Let's go. Ah. I know that most of us might be wondering why we called for this emergency meeting. Anyway, the purpose of this meeting is to let us know that it has been confirmed that Sir Caesar Maduka is dead. What? What happened? What a tragedy. When I saw him yesterday, he was looking healthy. Yeah, I saw him too. He wasn't showing any sign of being sick. What actually happened? Well, from what we heard, he just collapsed and died. Oh my God! What's a great fit? Hey! This is the A very, very bad news indeed. Hey! But uh, we cannot continue to sit here and lament over it like this. Hey! It has happened, it has happened. Yeah. So, what do we do? I think the best thing for us to do is to send some people to go and see the wife. Right there, right there. Yes, you can answer to the yes. My God! This is the height of inhumanity and wicked. I never knew that Choma is such a stone cold bitch that came into this family to kill my only brother for me. So, if he didn't come at the nick of time Sunday, my brother would have been a dead man. By the way, where is she? I don't know. By the time I got here, he was all alone in this house, trying to call her from the house. My God, how could you not be so heartless? I don't know why you didn't marry her. Eh? I don't know why you married her. It was surprising and shocking when I heard the news. 
But I met with him some couple of days ago. No one would have believed this. A great man. A legal luminary. He was an icon. Sorry about that. Thank you. Um. Excuse me. So, when is the funeral coming up? The family will meet and decide the date for the burial. Jane, how could you be so callous? So your plan is to kill my only brother, right? What are you talking about? Did your brother say to you that I did anything to him? Are you not the one that let him down his red condition? Are you not the one? Hey, hey, what is going on here? I heard voices. She knows what I'm talking about. <laughs> Listen, young lady. Choma just lost her dad, okay? And every member of the family is in a morning mood right now. And we wouldn't want this kind of scenario. Please. Mother, how are you? The Grandmaster is not happy with all of you. No, it's not around. He went for a meeting in India. But he said if Brotherhood cannot get Caesar's body, then there is no need for him to come back into this country for now. Uh, okay. Adam, um, I called you to let you know that um, you will not be coming regularly to the house anymore. But recently, I noticed that the fraternity has been on the trail of my sister and I. Yes, it has been monitoring both of us. So I wanted to take good care of the body. All right, Father, I will. <clears throat> Thank you very much, Father. You're welcome. Thank you. You're welcome. I, I appreciate all your efforts and understanding. All right, Father. Um, let me be on my way then. So, what are we doing? I checked you in the office earlier and you were in our home. My brother, I want to see Caesar's family. Okay. Hope they are good. Well, what would you do? They are bearing the loss with fortitude. So, any funeral arrangements yet? Um, not exactly, not exactly, but the wife said that they will be fixing the burial after their meeting. Okay. Hello, Barrister Walter. How are you? I'm fine, thank you, sir. How may I help you? Oh, please, Barrister Walter, I am here to know if I can get this information from you. I want to know if you know where they kept the body of uh, Caesar Madoka, my friend. My brother, my everything. Sorry, sir, I do not know. But I think that question should go to the family. You could ask Mr. Jana or Uchenna. It's okay. Thank you very much. I'll be on my way. So, uh, is it that surprising? Yeah, me, I was wondering, you know, I, I have a much better one. Thank God. This brotherhood or something is really, really bad. Honestly, the evil indeed. I mean, very devilish. Your father-in-law is dead. What? He died after he came here. My father-in-law dead. 
Lord. What have I done? I, I killed him. What do you mean? I mean, I'm responsible for his death. What? <laughs> what do you think, Fidelis? He won't understand. I would like to know when the Knight of St. Christopher will be going to the mortuary to pray for Nate Caesar Madoka. Who are you? Um, I am a friend with help and I try to meet the family, but no way. Why didn't you go to his house? I tried to get entry, but I couldn't. I just want to pay my last respect before I leave the country, because I do not know when the burial will be coming up. Alright. So, how do I contact you? Oh. Yes, my friend. It's all right today. I'm so, I'm sorry, Chama. Please, please forgive me. Okay? It's not to understand. What? Forgive you. Fidelis, I think you should leave this house right now. So, please, has he gotten to this point? Let me at least condole with my in law. What condolence? What rubbish? For what purpose? Leave this house before I become violent. Of course, son, of course, you can't do that. Huh? Get out! Where do you think you're coming from? Who do you think you are? You want to come and finish what you, what you started? Demon! Rubbish. Dan, who opened the gate for this idiot? I don't know. You don't know? You don't know? I don't want to see him in this compound anymore. Rubbish. Stupid ass. Condolence indeed. Don't come and finish what you started. Demon. Please start shut the gate. Don't expect any salary for this mess. Did I do wrong? Daddy, why? Daddy promised to love me, but you chose to kill me. Why, Daddy? Why? Daddy, why? I will fix everything up. Don't you? I said I will fix it up. It's okay. It's okay. 
Kocos Sensa I am not happy where I am I am in pain Where is your body? I say where is your body? Your dad was a great man, and so his funeral requires adequate planning because a lot of people will be in attendance. Yes, I know. And that's true, you know. It's not just a night of St. Christopher and the church. If you ask me, I know the bar association will be there, the confederation of non governmental organizations will be there, dignitaries from the um, government, so many people will be there, even the widows will be there. Yes, I know. I think you're right. We really need to give you that good plan. And one more thing, Father. I would like you to meet with the bishop as soon as he comes back so that we can give you some advice on the funeral. Yes, I'll do that as soon as he comes back. You know, we have to go and meet him and tell him he is that's very good friend. So. Oh, I'll definitely do that. Well, that's all right. Yes. I think we should call for a family meeting to know the way forward. Yes, it, it will be good. Uh, I have actually thought about it. Uh, and, uh, what do you want? Um, what are you coming here to do? Um, I came to tell you that Caesar is not happy where he is. He came to me and told me that he is in great pains. See that came to me. As God. Will you get out of my house? Get out of my house! Okay. You evil man! Get out! Devil himself! Son of Satan! Get out! See that came to me. It's okay, he's gone now. Can you imagine? Eh? This demon, that, that son of Lucifer, he, 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 he came and took my husband and did what I don't know. Now he has got to come back to talk rubbish. My God will visit all of you one by one. In fact, he will visit you people. Dara, demons, yakri, 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 cult people. Williams. Please, what I'm about to tell you now, I want you to keep it to yourself, okay? You see, that letter was given to my father-in-law by my wife. You see, I, I, I almost confessed, but I was struck by this, this, this force. I don't know where it's coming from. You did what? I, I had no shots. Like I saw myself trying to confess, I was so scared. I don't know. Shabbat Kudahes, Konsatavi Kudahes, Shabbat Kudahes, Konsatavi Kudahes, Ayy, 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 Ayy. Your father appeared to me today and told me that he's not happy where he is. Are you serious? We have to do something very fast. Oh, that is wicked. Who is now going to help us and feed our children? And who is now going to help us to train our children in school? Oh, that. Please, we want to see her so that we can greet her. Um, whatever what you said, they have to take it easy. God is a giver of life and he takes what he pleases him. We cannot question him. Caesar is gone. Yeah. Mm. 
Uh, who do you say you want to see? No man. Your wife, right? Okay, yeah, come on, come inside. Come inside, she's inside. Mm -hmm. The information of Rishi Mina is that my father's secret record members are seriously searching to know where we kept his body. And this is why I do not want to disclose this to anybody. If my mother was telling me that Odogu visited her, telling her that my father came to him, complaining to him that he's in great pains where we kept him. You see, the whole thing is confusing. <coughs> father! 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 So what is the problem? Who is that for you? Your father's corpse is missing! Listen, listen! Are you sure? I want to leave you. Helen. Have you seen the way I have been treated? Have you seen the way my stepmother has been treating me? Is that right? Just because I am not her biological son. Is that right? I'm asking you. It took away my father's corpse so I don't get to find him. Listen, I beg you in the name of God, please tell me where I can find my father's corpse and I'll give you anything. Just name anything and I'll give it to you. Uncle Williams, I'm sorry. I don't know. If I knew, I would have told you. You're lying to me, right? I don't know. Hello. How are you? I'm fine, thank you. Let me see. I heard what happened. How come you never called to tell me? I, I, I'm sorry. I was supposed to call you, but I didn't because I have been completely disorganized, okay? I have lots of things in my mind, but, but, but I'm sorry anyways, please. It's alright. What happened? Um, can we go to the main house so we can talk about it? Alright. Okay, I'll see you. Is anyone here? I want some water. Oh God, I'm thirsty. Anyone here? Water, please. Is anyone here? No. No, Angela. No, I killed you. I killed you. I killed you because you were getting rich. You were getting rich. And that was that was contravening my my agreement with the brotherhood. I'm supposed to be the only one rich in the family. That was why I used my brother's star, Jonah, your husband. But your riches was contravening my agreement with the brotherhood. I had to kill you to protect my wealth. No, 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 you are dead. I kill you. I killed you. He who destroy others. Destruction awaits him at the post of his success. And whosoever kills in order to live, death at the very door of his life. I'm thirsty. I'm just thirsty. <laughs> no, 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 no. Don't leave, please. Give me the water, please. I'm thirsty. 
liquid water. name of Jesus Christ, in Jesus' mighty name, mm -hmm. I come against every authority power this room, against every evil thing in this room, with the power and authority given to me, as one of the forces of Christ here on earth, I come against you now, I come against you now, I just sprinkle this room with the virgin blood, mighty Jesus Christ, I come against you now, out, 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 in Jesus' name, in the mighty name of Jesus Christ, pray. thank you Father, thank you Jesus, thank you Holy Spirit, in Jesus' most excellent and powerful name, I pray, Amen. Serious, yeah. <laughs> anyway, that's not important for now. Yeah. I saw Akuna and Chama with the mortician yesterday. You did? Yeah. Where did you see them? Saw so them around our neighborhood. Though they didn't see me. What are you doing here with Mr. Okolo, the mortician? No, no, it looks like they don't want people to see them. <laughs> um, sweetheart, can you, can you take me to where you saw them? Why? Um, you, you know my family members. They, they actually um, see me as a kid, like a little child. They feel if they take me to my, my late father, like if when I see the corpse, I'm going to get scared. Yeah. Am, I, am I not grown enough to see my father's corpse? I mean, I want to pay my last respect before he gets buried. Don't you think that's right? Yeah, yeah. I hope taking you there will not cause any problem. No, 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 no nobody's going to get angry with you. Listen, he's my father. Okay, I'm sure wherever he is right now, I, he needs me to come and see him. I mean, I need to pay my last respect. That's all I ask. Can you take me there now? Now, what are you suggesting? Well, um, to me, I think we should take him out from this place to another private place. Um, well, Father, in my own opinion, I am suggesting that it's not necessary to take him to another place since he's not going to stay here for too long. Well, you know, the recent uh, disturbances might have revealed to a lot of people that the late Caesar's body is kept here. You know, and uh, we don't want people to know where he's kept. All right, I understand your point. I will do exactly as you have said. It's okay. okay let me see you move along. So we can't find anybody in there. Eh? We can't find the cops. You can't find anybody. Nobody. You didn't see the cops. We can't find the cops. Are you sure of what you're saying? I'm very sure, sir. Thank you. 
I want to thank you all for showing so much interest about the death of your colleague. But the problem is that the family has not come up with any date for the burial. As soon as they do that, we let you know. Please, one more thing. We usually send some people to the mortuary to pray for our deceased member. So let us know when it will be convenient for you to take us there to perform our rites. No problem. We will do all that. Hmm? Uh, it's all right, madam. Uh, we have to be on our way now. Please take heart. Uh, God knows everything. We pray that the blessed Mother Mary will grant you the fortitude to bear the loss. They just move this body out of here. How could this be possible? What? I think they knew we were coming. But we must get it. Yes. We must get it. Yes. 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 Let's get out of here. Let's get out of here. Okay, we can sort this thing out. Come on, what? What do you mean by come down, Williams? Are you trying to defend a Fidelix or what? Eh? Listen to me. Fidelix, listen attentively. You have seen too much and there is no going back for you. See, how am I defending Fidelix? I'm only trying to calm the situation down. Is that how I'm defending you? Hmm? All I'm saying is we shouldn't make a mountain out of an issue we can handle and make him better. Well, excuse me, Williams. Um, I'm the one of contention here, if I'm not wrong. Um, are you trying to say I don't have a choice here? I'm afraid. Yes. You sealed your fate the moment your request came to the problem and the letter was sent to you. Um, Fearless. Listen, he's absolutely right. A letter of induction was sent to you and you fully know about it. So that automatically means you have to be in your next meeting. And you cannot say no to it. There's no going back. Excuse me? Yes. See, no one no, no, no messes with this woman. Yeah. 